Check your safety watch now and those viral social media posts claiming hand sanitizer can spontaneously combust into a fire in a hot car. This morning we're hearing directly from Colorado Springs firefighters on that topic. News size Renee Skinner live from the fire department headquarters with more on what we all need to know about this Renee. Oh yeah, Ira, good morning to you. Good morning to everyone. I spoke to an investigator with the Colorado Springs Fire Department and he tells me keeping a small bottle of hand sanitizer in your glove compartment or in that middle console is not going to cause it to all of a sudden catch fire. It doesn't quite work that way, but he does tell me the ingredients that typically make up hand sanitizers are not prone to spontaneously bursting into flames. It may be possible for sunlight to cause magnification through your hand sanitizer bottle, which can then cause a fire. The bottle has to have liquid. The liquid has to be clear. The bottle has to be clear and sunlight has to pass through it at exactly the right angle in order for a fire to happen. You would also need an ignition temperature of above 700 degrees and usually our parked cars only reach 200 degrees. So no hand sanitizers are not a big concern for the fire department here, but they are seeing a rise in a different type of fire. We always use a good receptacle to dispose of your cigarette butts. Uh, those ends of those cigarettes can be very hot and they can smolder for quite a while. If you drop those on the ground, they sit in the grass, they smolder, the wind picks up and it stokes that fire. Chris Cooper went on to say there is a proper way to put out a cigarette. Be sure to douse cigarettes with water or sand to make sure you put them out all the way. And before discarding cigarette butts and ashes in the trash, douse them again with water to make sure they don't catch fire. Now back to the hand sanitizer issue. Again, a lot has to happen in order for a fire to, uh, to happen as a result of hand sanitizer being left in your car. Also, the alcohol content has to be pretty high in order for that to happen. And also, in general, it's just not a good idea to leave hand sanitizer in your car because the more sunlight it is exposed to, the less potent it will become. Always watching out for you, Southern Colorado, Renee Skinner, News 5.